FireAmp and AMP for Firepower are two components of SourceFire's advanced malware protection solution, featuring retrospective security. It's the only solution that uses big data analytics and continuous analysis capabilities to detect, track, scope, analyze, and remediate advanced malware missed by other security layers. When it comes to advanced malware, we are finding that clients are struggling with some tough questions. SourceFire can help with all these questions, but in this video, we're going to focus on the trajectory capabilities available in both FireAmp and AMP for Firepower. It's a powerful feature to help you quickly understand the scope of your malware problem. Think of trajectory as a flight recorder for malware. It shows you when and where malware has entered your network and where it has spread, while at the same time tracking the entire lineage and history of what it does. First, trajectory helps you understand the scope of malware or suspicious files on your network. Here we can see the three most recent trajectory events for files at the top and for devices at the bottom. You can also leverage SourceFire's big data capabilities to search by SHA, device name, URL, and IP address for related trajectories. Drilling into the file trajectory detail page, we can see when the malware first entered the network, as well as which system was infected first. This computer represents patient zero. File trajectory also shows all the applications responsible for introducing the malware, and the trajectory pane below shows the systems impacted by the malware and the lineage of how malware landed on the system and how it is spreading. These icons tell you things like which systems have executed malware versus which systems have only downloaded it, and that can help you prioritize who gets help first. For instance, someone who has executed the malware might be at a higher risk than someone who has only downloaded it. Click on any of the systems with activity and trajectory shows you the application responsible for introducing the malware. 